Uh, hopefully later this year we'll do our first uh, human uh, device implantation and this will be for, for someone that has uh, sort of tetraplegic, quadriplegic, um, does not have, it has lost the connection from their, their brain to their body. Um, and we, we think we should be able to, that person will be able to uh, communicate uh, as fast as someone who has a fully functional body. Um, so that's going to be a big deal. And we, and we see a path beyond that uh, to actually transfer the signals from the motor cortex of the brain to pass the injury in the spinal cord and actually um, enable someone's body to be used again. So um, essentially shunting the signals past the broken point um, and, uh, and restore potentially full, full body um, use to someone that has uh, completely lost the connection. And I mean, you can imagine like if say Stephen Hawking were alive today, what a profound change that would be. Um, and um, so that's our first application. And uh, if uh, it's, it's looking like that, the first case will be later this year. Thank you.